All right, so today I'm out here at the uh, Rose Bowl Aquatic Center parking lot uh, for Econo West, which is basically a, a Ford Econoline band show. Uh, primarily, it's for like the first gen vans, but there's some second gen vans, and you know they're they're open to pretty much any van showing up. There's even like a Chevy and then a, like a Dodge A100. Uh, so I'm gonna film the show and uh, show you what's here. So there's a cool like first gen uh, Econoline Falcon wagon. I guess you talked to this guy earlier, he does engraving, so he was kind of showing off some of his work. It's a really cool van. Got a uh, Dodge A100 pickup truck. As you can see, a lot of people still use these for their businesses. Um, I mean, these are really, really, both the Fords and the Dodges, even the Chevys, I mean, they're just, they're beefy trucks, they can still be used uh, for everyday use. These are really cool, these A100 pickup trucks. Uh, if you look inside, I mean, see it's got the, got the uh, doghouse right in the middle. This guy's got a locking box on it. And he uses it for his handyman business. Black plate car. Uh, here's my van, my, my 73 Econoline. You can see I got the windows out right now. I'm actually uh, in the process of redoing the inside. So I gutted it because I had mushrooms growing on the inside and lots of mold. So still working on it. As you can see, it's a work in progress. But I mean, I'll get it back going. As soon as I'm done, I'll make another, like an update video on it. But it's, it's definitely been coming along. It actually runs really well. Another second gen Econoline. This one actually has uh, motorhead written on the side. She has got the swivel seats, the custom wheel. It's got a nice fan for cooling off on hot days. Full on shag carpet everywhere, as you'd expect on a 70s van. There's like a Chevy uh, Chevy half ton van, short body. A nice interior. He's got like a center console there. His door. I'm not going to touch his door, but he's got his bed in the back. Ready to go camping. Trigger SS's. I can be. Got the swap meter area. But I'm not at work, so. Lots of good stuff. They're getting ready to. They didn't tell you no cameras allowed? No cameras allowed? <laughs> oh, great. So I screwed that one up. <laughs> yeah, I'm allergic to film. There you go. Well, good thing it's digital. Oh, good. You got Bohawk. There you go. Okay. Another first gen Econo line. Cool Econo line pickup truck. Pickups are real cool. They're getting hard to find that weren't completely beat into the ground. So you can imagine a lot of these were used for like uh, all sorts of businesses. And it's getting hard to find them in any sort of a decent shape. Confusion Van Club. Some of the goodies they have for sale. Got the cool vintage mini bike. Eight door pass through uh, first gen van. Up north, you know. Yeah. Lots of neat buttons and pins for sale. Uh, 
bit of a crowd around this guy. This is the uh, Silverado van. Yeah. And it's you got stain the, that uh, wood? Custom airbrush. Yeah. You stained it. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Pop out windows in the back. Loads of bubble out. There's a better shot of his uh, mule. He's got the flares kind of like uh, body worked. Under the metal, no seams. Alright, lots of people starting yeah, to show up. The more items for sale carburetors, all sorts of things, little models. The second gen Econoline van I talked to him, he just sold this for uh, $1,500. I guess it's going to San Diego. I'm sure it'll get completely refurbished. It's like he had shag carpeting at one time, too. Definitely a good builder. Doesn't look like it's too rusty. Original license plates. That's tag 04. I think he said it was non op, so that's a good thing for the new owner. This guy says he just bought this club wagon out of Oregon a few uh, months ago. It's like super clean. I think he said he got the original owner. It's a really sharp original brand. Another Conline pickup truck. It's a pretty sweet first gen panel. Okay, they did a really nice job on this one. So on this guy's got his rack with his surfboard, his luggage, he's ready to go. He's got a Coleman uh, fridge in here, rice box, all his Coleman goodies. Got his uh, beer tap, beer shift lever. More stuff to sell. Some nice original uh, kind of mine falcon wagon. How's it going? It's happening. Yeah, mine had full. It's a cool short body, flat blacked. All right, so that's about all we have here at Econo Fest at the Rose Bowl. Uh, thanks for watching. Please be sure to to subscribe if you want to see more videos, especially videos about vans and stuff I'm working on, car show videos and things like that. Uh, I'm going to be doing the Malays show here in a couple weeks uh, in El Segundo, uh, probably with my AMC Pacer. Uh, I'm actually going to be going to the uh, Chrysler, the uh, Spring Fling Mopar show tomorrow uh, with the Pacer, and I'm going to be shooting a video there as well. So, like I said, uh, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to comment and subscribe. Thank you.